fixing a color cast inside Lightroom. Command or Control Shift U to fix the white balance. D select D for the development module. Increase the black slightly, and done. Open our image inside Photoshop. Select the background layer. Command or Control J to duplicate the layer. Select Filter, Other, High Pass. Adjust the radius. Select OK. Change the layer blend mode to soft light. Select the layer 1, Command or Control E to merge the layers together. Repeat again if necessary. Cropping and removing distractions. Select the Crop tool, draw a selection around, move your photo, double click, select the Marquee tool, on the right hand side of the image, draw a rectangle, Control J or Command J to duplicate just that section, Edit, Transform, Flip it horizontal, move it over your distraction, create a layer mask, fill the layer mask with black, select your brush tool, using white as your foreground color, paint out the distraction. Control E or Command E to flatten the image. Zoom in on the next distraction. Using the new spot healing brush, make sure content aware is selected. Trace over the distraction. Once completed, go back and just fine-tune any areas that weren't, weren't duplicated properly. Zoom out and we're done. We're ready for our artist interpretation of this image. Select the crop tool. I'm going to recrop it again. Selecting our image. Double click. Now from the, filter, the file menu we're going to go to automate and we're going to use Nick Software's focal point. From inside focal point under the blur tab we're going to make sure the lens choice is the Nikon 85 1.8 at 5.6. Position the focal grid over our image. Select Apply. Before and after. This is where the fun can begin. First step, we're going to create an adjustment layer. U and saturation. We're going to remove the um, the yellow the yellow bottle. We're going to tone it down just a touch. Move lightness down and the saturation just a little. Select the layer. Control E or Command E to flatten it. File, automate, Nick effects, and we're going to select Glamour Glow. Select Brush. We're going to fill the entire image with the effect. And now we're going to paint out the areas that we don't want. In this case, the hands. Select Apply. Zoom out. 
zoom out a little bit before and after control E to merge down now file automate photo tools from the preset one of our favorites is the grunge the grunge effect click on grunge select normal apply next effect will be the rain apply once select apply one last step create another adjustment layer this time solid color select a brown change the layer blend mode to color and then apply the opacity to your desired settings control or command E to merge down now quick overview this is what we started with and this is where we ended